Hey guys, it's Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports. Right behind me we have another Ford Mustang. This is a 2004 Cobra. So this has the 32 valve, 4.6 liter with an Eaton supercharger on it. So it whines when you're going through the gears. It is a beautiful sound. Pretty much stock other than exhaust, new tires, the list goes on. If you guys want to find out full details on this one, click on the link below. It'll have underside shots and a full gallery. Let's do a nice comprehensive walk around. Let's take a look at the overall condition. I would rate this one an 8 out of 10. Shows extremely well. Paint is even throughout, even on the bumpers. Chrome wheels have no pitting. Tires are brand new. They are Pilot Sport all seasons. All of your trim throughout is black. There is no fading. The glass on the front, there are no chips, and there is tint on the front glass, so if you're in a certain state where you can't have that, you're, you're going to have to remove that. Power top works as it should. All of your body lines are even. This has a clean Carfax. It has, I believe, 51,000 original miles on it, and we'll have all the details for this one in the link below. So if you want to see the underside shots, the whole nine yards, just click on that. As I open up the driver's side door, all the rubbers look good. Your stickers are still intact here for your VIN number. And I love this color combination. So you have the exterior that's silver, black Alcantara, black leather. That is so nice. This is a 2004 model. You have a six-speed transmission, 390 horsepower, Unbelievable fun, especially with the top down. This is a true cruiser that anybody can jump in and have fun with, and these love modifications. Like 1200 bucks, and you've got 450 plus horsepower. Tail lights look good, deck lid looks good. Let's spin it around for the passenger side, and then we'll show you the interior and then the engine. Passenger side looks the same as the driver's side. All of your body gaps are even throughout. Plastic trim right here is very nice. Once again, windscreen looks good. Windshield wipers are brand new. I love the hoop design for the, for the Cobra. It just gives it that sinister look. When you open up the passenger side door, same condition. And the bolsters on these seats, you wouldn't think it has 51,000 miles. Very, very clean, very maintained. Rear seat sections are very nice too. Door closes nicely. And then once again, you have 275, 40, 17 Michelin Pilot Sports. You know, Michelin, the big guy. <laughs> Let me show you the interior and then we'll continue on with the test drive. Test drive, we're still walking around it, John. Let's take a look at the interior. Door cards are very nice. Your seats, as I said before, you would not know that there's 51,000 miles on it. Leather looks good, the Alcantara looks good. Steering wheel is in excellent condition. Lights operate, my favorite glow is the green glow. I don't know if you guys remember that video from uh, YouTube, it was like 10 years ago of these two guys doing a high speed run in one of these cars, it was a hard top. And then the police, they, the Valentine one starts going off and the police see it and then they hit it again. He's in fifth gear at 160 and he shifts into sixth gear and continues on to Mulberry Road is what they said, Mulberry Road. Back to this one. So glass is nice, it's been tinted in the front. You do have a factory radio with a six CD player and I'm gonna include six CDs in there. Glove box is very nice and it does have the owner's manual. I love the pedals on these cars. So you have that aluminum around the pedals. Horn works. When I get inside, very comfortable. The door closes nicely. And I have the SVT booklet here with just the manual, essentially. So we'll put that back in there. Shifter is very nice. Six speed manual. This is for your convertible top, which we'll show you later on in the video. Air condition works. E brake is holding. Rear seats look like no one's ever sat back there. This is a beautiful piece. All the windows work as well, so that's why all the windows are down for this photo shoot. I think this is a really nice piece. I know a lot of people hate on convertibles, but this is like you have all the fun in the sun and it still has the ability to party. So that's my take on a convertible Terminator. Let's open up the hood and show you the power plant. Let me show you the power plant. <laughs> Taking a look at the engine bay, very clean. You have your Eaton supercharger here, 390 horsepower factory, 390 foot-pounds of torque factory. And when people put these on the dyno stock, that's the number they're getting to the wheels most of the time. So that's pretty impressive. Super cheap to modify, and I totally think that whoever buys this should do it. Pulley, intake, tune, done. Uh, shifter feels great, and we're going to do that in the video. 
all of your plastics are proper, and can you guess what's missing in this engine bay right now? Do you know? The snout cover. So there's a factory cover that goes here to protect the pulley. That's not in place. But I think it looks better like that. You get to see the supercharger working instead of hiding it. Uh, all of your valve covers look good. There's no smoke or hesitation when you start it up. Um, very, very healthy, brand new battery. And this was driven 300 miles before we actually purchased it to the location where we got it. So really cool piece, a little bit of wear on the top half right here for the insulation. Otherwise, it's nice, original, and stock, minus the exhaust. Let's go for a test drive. Before we go for a test drive, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoy it, please be sure to click like and subscribe below. That's going to give the whole team here a boost of confidence. And today, we're going to do something special. So we love Fox bodies and Terminators here. And I'm sure if you're watching this video, you do too. Whoever has the best Terminator comment in our section below and highest like count on that comment is going to receive a Wine For Me decal. So we'll choose the top five comments and send you guys over a decal. So keep a lookout. And if you guys want to order one of these, click on the link below. Let's go for a test drive. So we're going to take this 2004 Terminator for a test drive. Basically, the only modifications would be exhaust and intake. Uh, air condition works as it should. We have the top down because it's beautiful here in South Florida today. AC blows cold, very cold. I'm weird. I have to have the gate, all of the, uh, the things in the center when I have it off. Uh, visors look good. You do have a Mach 460 stereo. Stock shifter, 51,000 miles in the odometer. Temperature is slowly rising. You still have the upshift light there, so it's not been eliminated. Uh, I love the interior because it has the black Alcantara and the black leather. The bolsters are very nice. Clutch is easy. I don't know if the clutch is original or not. We'll test out uh, in fifth gear to see if it slips, which I don't, doesn't, but I'm gonna show you anyways. Second gear, no issues at all. Third gear. Let's go into fifth. No slippage at all, accelerating. 390 horsepower, 390 foot pounds of torque. And the best part is the sound. Oh, yeah. We're going to drive west on 84, go over the bridge, and then turn around and go get a little bit more fun. We'll, go, we'll accelerate with it so you can see it go through the gears. Right now, drivability is very nice. Shifting feels good. Um, a radio does operate. Just turned it on, it's on CDs, and it does have six CDs included, and I'm not gonna tell you what's inside there. Radio works. Clutch is easy off of first gear. <laughs> That's the best sound ever. Third. Horn works. Let's see if the cruise control works. Cruise control is holding. Windows operate. Even the rears. The exhaust note's not too loud either. Fourth gear. I like it. Let's see if the lights work. Lights operate. Seats are very comfortable. Downshifting it. <laughs> Brakes are even. This is a fun part of the video where we test it out. If you guys have any questions, give us a call, 954-363-2261. If you enjoy this content, please be sure to click like and subscribe below. We showcase these cars exactly as they are, so you guys have a really good idea of what you're getting. Let's test out the acceleration. Ready? Oh, that will never get old. Brakes are even. Downshifting it. It feels good. <laughs> Nothing like a 4.6 with the eating on it. We're going to take it right here, go over the bump so you can see how the suspension reacts. Turn signals are operating.
Very drivable car, 51,000 miles. I would call that low mileage for something like this. You can drive it still, not worry about it. Paint is very nice. Wheels are in excellent condition. Tires are great. We'll do the bumps in third gear. Once again, if you guys have any questions, give us a call, 954-363-2261. I'm out of here.